so welcome back to another video here on the Fred the Digger YouTube channel. Today we're working at the pastor of my church's house actually and um, he just put in a little barn which you might be able to see all the way up there. So what we're doing is we're digging out the ground in front of it so that we can haul in stone later today and throw down a little driveway pad deal that'll connect to his existing driveway um, over to his barn. So that's what we got going today. Thank you guys very much for watching and we'll just hop right into this. Well there you go, first load and she's already stuck. Locker didn't seem to want to work so Jake's coming with the skid steer and we still got half a load. It's not super buried but it's slick enough. All she does is spin. So he's put, he's tried pulling me, he's tried pushing me. We can't get the sucker. I'm in low, low. She doesn't want to move. She wants to stay stuck. We got her in low, low, and he's cleaning out some of the stuff we tried to dump to try and see if we could pull out with less weight. All right, attempt number like four. He's got some chains. Uh, I'm going to lower the bed a little bit. This doesn't even look that bad, but the other side's deeper. And then it just gets stuck and she digs her ruts and she won't get out. So we dumped, well what the heck, most of it came out. There's still a bunch in there, but you can see that's the ruts from the last one. Two foot deep or something. This side's deeper. <sighs> that's not fun stuff right there. I do not want to be don't want to have to pull the sucker out every single time we have to go dump it because that's just slow that's inefficient and that's essentially a waste of time but we'll pull this out and then we'll get to actually what we're what we're here to do <laughs> hey got her out but it was just easier to just pulled it out but at this point i don't think i'm just i'm not gonna keep showing it every keep having to get it stuck. Jake's grading off uh, where I dumped the second pile and the first pile so hopefully we get something that we can drive on and not just slime and sink through. So yeah I'm just gonna throw you guys up there um, opposed to just watching me get stuck every five minutes so we'll get we'll get back to work in here. <laughs>
that's what she looks like. She's been pretty much all stripped out now. Jake's just finishing loading up. The last should be last load. Might not, might be a little too much for one load. Might have to do a load and a half, but we'll get this loaded up, dumped out there, and then uh, have them start bringing stone to start filling this in with stone. And I'll go grab the roller, and then we'll see what she looks like when we get back. All right, so you can see this is the piles we got. That last pile we did get stuck again then after that one. So I was uh, three for four on getting stuck with doing these, but he's gonna level that off, grade it off, make it all nice and flow so we burn it off there. But yeah, that's what he's doing. Uh, I'm gonna go get the roller and then we'll check back in. And by the time I get the roller, he should, uh, he should have that done. Maybe part of that, most of that done. And I think uh, they'll have most of the stone down, um, at least the base layer. So, go get the roller quick. got all this is number two recycled concrete that's why there's a little, little piece of brick here and a uh, little piece of pipe here or whatever this is the base layer because two is a lot solider material it packs down pretty good and it packs down as a solid good base and then uh, we'll get the top material in grade that off to level I would assume level with the edge of the dirt there as you see it this little ridge and obviously with the concrete over here. So we just gotta bring the top material in. I don't know what the top material is. Um, I'm gonna find out here pretty soon because the, the guy that's hauling us, uh, one of our truckers that's hauling us uh, this, all the materials, he uh, should be here pretty soon. We'll get to grading. Some unscreened millings. I'm gonna say that because it has chunks like this. So I gotta jump in and make a correct correction right here. They were screen millings. When I looked at the pile, I saw those few chunks on the outside and I just assumed that they were uh, unscreened millings, but they were screen millings. Uh, the chunks on the outside, I would just assume were the frozen crust on the outside from the piles probably have been frozen a bit. So it probably got broken up and then made those little chunks on the outside. So normal screen millings would not have those chunks in them. Um, and even when we started working in and diving into the pile, there was only just those couple chunks that you saw on the outside. Those were the only chunks in the whole thing. So my bad, I said they were unscreened. They were screened. Screened millings would only be this finer stuff right here. Because going through the screen, screens all that stuff out, obviously. That's what a screen is. So these will pack down really nice once rolled and it'll be really smooth. And at that point, it basically it basically turns into asphalt at that point because it packs down really well if you let it set good. Real good product to have here. That's what I, like I said, it's it's like it's their driveway material, uh, what their driveway material is now. 
but if you can see on the edge you'll you can kind of see how part of the edge this is like it's almost like the edge of of, a, of asphalt right and so that's packed down asphalt millings and so that'll end up this whole thing right here will all end up just like that it'll end up packed down hard um, with the roller obviously rolling it but it'll get packed down hard and this will be just smooth and it'll actually be really nice we got to get uh, Jake up here grading he's grading off up there I don't think you can really see him off in the distance but He's grading off up there, finishing that, and then he'll be back here and grading this stuff. So we'll be done pretty soon. Actually, we're not about done. We are done. So this is what she looks like now. She's all graded off, smoothed off, packed down hard. Anyways, that's a wrap for this job. I wanted to say thank you very much for watching. Um, uh, if you enjoyed the video, like, hit the subscribe button if you want to see more. And uh, yeah, just thanks very much for watching. And we'll see you in the next one. Hey.